Nigerian singer Olowutaiwo, popularly known as LT Skills, on his media tour visited AIT to give insight on his journey so far in the music industry. After a series of eight singles, LT Skills entered on an upcoming EP which will be released before the end of the year. I'm from um, a, polyg a polygamous setting. Um, my mom, which Miss uh, Eretta Kosoko, she's the late Miss Eretta Kosoko. Um, I'm the firstborn of four my mom and then I say I'm the first one because I'm 12 minutes older than my twin brother. You can argue with your ancestors, but I was seen out there. Yes, so uh, I'm the first one of four. Um, I'm a single dancer. I studied banking and finance. And uh, let's see, my childhood was just fun, dramatic. It was um, life, you know. Actually, I learned a lot about life while growing up as an entertainer and also as the son of an entertainer, also. Are you feeling the dance? Move your body to the dance floor. It's better not get fat. Started when I was seven years old, I saw my uncle dancing and then I watched who he was dancing to was Michael Jackson and I wanted to just be like Michael Jackson and since then I've always, I started as a dancer and then professionally from secondary school I danced, 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 danced until professionally I kicked off as a choreographer and I kicked off my music later in 2013, professionally. Uh, there wasn't there was plan for Lucy remix initially, but then there was an Amma Piano party, they told me to do the Amma Piano version of it. And then I was like, after the performance, I was like, I need to do this remix. I love this beat and I love the sound of it, but then who would be the perfect person to put in it? I ob obviously, if you want to think, of, think about music, you, think, you want to think about Afro House, Amma Piano, who is going to come to mind? That's the queen of Amma Piano. She's the one that came to my mind first, and I was like, I'd like to put her on the song. And she heard the song. And then she was like, I want to meet this artist. And then we bonded from there. Oh, Galala is actually an Afrocentric song. I actually wanted to mix uh, a feel of African sound mixed with uh, with EDM. I, I'm, a, I'm a big fan of a EDM, yes, an electric dance machine. And I was like, I need something. But I've had the idea for over over 10 years. But then we actually had to do the song. Big shout out to Chris Beats, what they produced. And big shout out to Clarence Peters, who shot the video. And it was dope. It came out really, really well. And I actually, what I had in my mind was what was portrayed in the audio and the video. It's all about celebrating the dance, also celebrating Afro culture while blending the Western culture into it. No, no, no album for now. All, all I've had is uh, singles. Uh, I'm about to drop my recent work, which is Body of Work, as my EP, and it consists of six tracks. Yeah, I just released uh, two songs actually. Um, one was DJ Fokati featuring me, and the second one is Emotions, which is of, of my upcoming EP. Emotions is about um, relationship, you know, um, about you wanting to be sure, you know, basically whether a guy or a girl wants to be sure where they stand in the life of someone that they love, but they're not sure if the person reciprocates as much as they think. They want to be sure if they are, if it's true love or not. I like to start tell.
uh, December is going to be a lot. Okay, I actually have some tours coming real soon. Then my also EP will be dropping, and this December is going to choke. It's your man come to me, yeah. cause you know you need me. I'll be the cure to your sickness. Oh, you work my treatment. I don't blend you like whiskey. What's up, guys? I go by the name Elta Skills, and you're watching Better on the Move on AIT. Don't change that there.